Okay. Alright guys, we're just we chilling with Frank for a little bit. <laughs> we're gonna film a lot of stuff for his channel and stuff like that. You look like a rabbit. Dude, he's actually really, he's pretty damn big. Like if you look at his proportions and everything, like he's a big dude. Like. Man inspired me to come up. Seriously, I didn't know what counting macros until I saw the video. And then like, I got, a, I got a scale, I was like, I have to be like this, OCD. Yeah. Yeah, now he's crazy. Dude, do you, do, you, do you really like have a scale all the time? Not all the time. No. This guy doesn't dude, count dude. macros. No, I don't even count macros. Oh like shit, why? You like beyond that now? Well, no, I don't. <laughs> so you like your, your brain knows the amount of macros. Yeah. So he's elevated. Machine. Generally, yeah. To the I'm, kind of like, I'm not there yet. It's like it's, I'm this guy right there. Oh shit. Like he knows, man. He just knows. He already knows. Dude, that's what Scooby said. He said he doesn't count anymore because he knows. Yeah. I bet. I Deep. bet. Well, once you I'm do it for so long, long, I'll be careful. You almost ran over Vivian. Yeah, once you do it for long enough, like you kind of just like know everything that's in. So. Well, plus his body is like primed to eat whatever. And yeah, well, yeah. Body is right. elevated, man. Like transcendence. Transcendence. Yeah. Transcendent. That was a movie, but I'm, I'm transcended beyond macros. Yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah. when I, but when I like try to cut, we should, we should record this. Oh, I have been. I know these conversations should be yeah, we should all this, is, this is cool, man. I have Sometimes been. me and Matt have this crazy con- Are you putting right Yeah, yeah, I got it. Because <laughs> this is both me, yeah. I guess I could. You can't! You can't shit! You can't son of a- Yeah! Yeah! Alright, ready? Ready! Instagram, Titanium Fitness with a Y, T, Y, T. Uh, same thing with the YouTube channel, uh, Tyler Yasuda. My homie up, Tyler hit something. He uh, has been killing it this year, and he's defending his uh, team title at the Mayhem. Shred it. Do a... Uh... Yeah, this is pretty sick, man. Alright, now hit a Jeff. You'll be worshipped, bro. <laughs> Oh, 
For example, let's just say, for example, when I was in the Marine Corps, I didn't like being there. And I think back of every other time that I'm there, I'm like, oh, I remember last week when I did this, it was shitty. Now when I think about it, I'm like, oh, yeah, those were kind of good times, good times. Right, right, yeah. Maybe it gets colored in so much. It gets right, right. So much. Or just defaults. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Defaults yeah. to, like, good times, even though maybe they weren't. Yeah, right. And then uh, that ties back to my chat. He was talking about the, uh, the workout thing we did. How the original oh. workout, and he passed it on. The way he gets to use, I'm really fucked up. Yeah. yeah, the next person is going to even more like... Yeah, but better. except for CrossFit, because they all do the same thing. Except for CrossFit, because they do the same shit. Yeah. The bodybuilding is so many ways you can... Be right yeah. back doing burn. What's it called? Fit Fina? Fat? What? I don't know. CrossFit. They have a name. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, bodybuilding, there's so many ways you can build muscles and so many different diets. Yeah. It's like so many ways you can remember something and then you get some sort of sort of sort And it changes and it changes, changes and changes. Yeah. changes. Except for CrossFit. Right. It's so it's the same. same. Yeah, but it's also why they don't get but it. But that's like kind of good. But it's always the same. It's kind of bad too. Yeah. Because you don't have any progression. Yeah. So like, yeah. So memory is like a double-edged sword. It's like humans and memories, it, but it also mislead us. But at the same time, it keeps us dead. Like, we are what we are. Yeah, we but, are if, but if memories were 100%, that would be you, fucked up too, actually. If you yeah. had a bad time, yeah. you could never forget yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. And it would haunt you yeah, for the rest exactly. of your life. So it's like a double-edged sword. Right. Like if you got right. fucked up, raped, molested, or something like that, it'd be terrible. You would never right. forget it. It's like bodybuilding. Somebody would do it. If you do, if you do it right, you, you know, you got it right. You it's, can, you it's can like, be fucked up. It's, it's like drawing up a, a picture on yeah. a beach. Yeah. And then like it just, every time the tide comes in, it's a little bit more fuzzier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, Eventually you forget that shit. But then there's the thing with CrossFit is that, like, yeah, you can follow that one program that gets released on the website or whatever, or your gym's program. But there's a lot of people that train their own way. 
Like I'm sure that Rich, what's his name, Rich Froning, yeah. doesn't go on, doesn't go on CrossFit.com and look up, huh, what do they want me to train? So he's thinking like, okay, what do I have to do so I can win the daily event? Right. And he does his own training for. So I guess at the high, high, high levels of CrossFit, they almost train like more bodybuilders, really goal specific. No, I don't think bodybuilders. They, they train like athletes. Well, no, I mean like, no, like, 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 yeah, yeah. like athletes. Like they don't listen to what other people tell them to do, which the bottom CrossFit does. Like, oh, I have to do this for today, I do it. Brand, it's called brand. Yeah, brand, like brand. Yeah. But those guys, they train goal specific for the, the right. Like athletes. Like an Olympic athlete. Yeah. Like if you do MMA, you, you don't you don't go and uh, you, come, you don't go to play or get back. You fight. And then you work on strength conditioning as an accessory movement to get bigger and stronger within your weight class. I don't know about crossbow. Oh, you don't. What about MMA? Do you ever watch MMA? No, but Joe Rogan does my movie. Yeah. I think it's crazy. Dude, it is. It's great sport. Who's your favorite MMA fighter? It's very primal. Like, yeah, yeah, it's very primal. It's like one of the real things. Like, like man versus so, man. It's like, so real. Like, yeah, yeah. 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 It's not like, hey, you're not allowed to do this style. You're not allowed to do this. You do literally anything you can do in a fight. He, he, he's kind of like, he's kind of like rap battles. Like freestyle rap battles. So that's for the body. You know? And maybe it's for the body. It's like an yeah. acapella yeah. freestyle rap battle yeah, 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 without yeah. a beat though. Or it's like they're making their own beat. You know what I mean? Because they're not restricted by it. Okay, oh, you remember how I said film festival is like bodybuilding for the body? Because film festivals, you can actually have to take time to make the movie aesthetic and right, right. nice and, and, and you present it. You present it. is like that. But MMA is more like freestyle rap where you just go at the person. Right, right. It's like a mental battle. Yeah. So but, it, but you know, the thing is like, if, if you have a DJ that's like hosting, uh, MCing uh, the freestyle rap battle, and he played beats that were only advantageous you for your style really of rap. You think you can get us out? Versus my style of rap is like a more a slow paced, melodic, monotonous, and yours like high speed, like jabs and. Uh, you think you can get the sound screen? I'll put cash in. Wait, wait, what? Do you, think, now, do you think we can get the sound? We were talking like. Oh, it's a little hard. Oh, his cake.